Hello, James here. In this tutorial, we will explore the memorizing world of generating line art or sketch drawing using the ControlNet extension in Stable Diffusion and Automatic 11.11. By the end of this video, you will know how to use AI image from Stable Diffusion, Mid Journey, or any other image AI generator to sketch drawing style image. You can even put your real photo, like your pet's favorite item or place, into sketch. Prepare to witness stunning examples with the clear edges of art created by a skilled pencil or pen. Let's dive straight into this creative journey. Okay, so first and foremost, open your Google Colab and run the Photon model for Stable Diffusion. If you are unsure about setting up Google Colab, don't worry, you can find a link to a helpful guide in the description below. Here we are at the Stable Diffusion web UI. If this is your first time using ControlNet, you shall need to generate an image from the text to proceed with it. However, since I already have an image ready, I shall directly navigate to the Image to Image section. Once in the Image to Image section, simply drag the white background image here. Scroll down to find the ControlNet extension. Open it and you shall see a range of options available. As mentioned earlier, I have an image readily available, so I shall proceed by dragging it from my folder and dropping it here. Okay, so now it's time to configure the settings. Follow along with me, making the same adjustment for the Control Net extension. Keep in mind that your results may vary. Depending on the prompts and negative prompts, so feel free to experiment with different prompts and settings to achieve your desired outcome. Next, let's write the prompt and negative prompt. I've already prepared the prompt on my notepad, which includes several relevant keywords to achieve the desired line art results from my image. You too can customize your prompt by adding more keywords for line art generation. Don't forget to include the negative prompt as well. Once everything is ready, Click Generate. Please note that getting the exact results you desire may require several attempts. It's not uncommon for the acceptable result to emerge after a few tries. Yes, we did it. Our line art is now ready, and you can compare it to the original image to witness the astounding transformation. That concludes today's tutorial. Thank you for joining me and I look forward to sharing more exciting content with you in our next session. See you next time.